Welcome to the Gear Swap episode 6. Don't get the ick. This is... This is week number 6, episode number 6. Welcome to everybody here in the chat. Thank you so much for coming. Hello, host. How are you guys doing tonight? Yeah, don't get the ick. Don't get the ick. That's going to be a recurring theme tonight. Don't get the ick. That's fair. I definitely stole that from you. <laughs> oh, it's nice to see you guys all in the chat. Thank you for coming out on this beautiful, wonderful disease ridden Wednesday. We are, <laughs> we're starting about a half. Yeah, it's a disease ridden Wednesday. We are starting about a half hour late today. Yeah, we're, we're a half hour late. We had a Windows update. Windows decided it wanted to make uh, my default program Microsoft Edge for everything. So, thanks, Microsoft. You can go fuck yourself. Uh, yeah, no shit. Um, there's going to be a lot of swearing tonight. I'm just, I'm done with today. It's over. So, go ahead. Have at it. Christian, how was your week? You're first. Uh oh. Hold on a second, guys. I think our audio is messed up here. Yep, yep, yep. We messed up. Shop. Oh, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. We'll fix it. All right. You guys should be. What did I. There you go. What did I do during my week? Oh, my. It's like it all passed. It was all a blur. And everything. It's all a blur. Yeah, it was all a blur. I don't even remember. I managed! Oh my gosh, I forgot! Oh my jeez. Okay, I was in charge. Uh, you said I was in charge. I was in charge and I forgot. Freaking, how did I forget that I managed? Oh well. How did I go? You told me, man. How'd it go? Not, yeah, nah, what'd you do? not bad. Not bad. I'd say I did decent. Okay. Decent. Okay. Like how you would expect a first time manager to act, you know? <clears throat> and then today, my highlight, I played a session. <laughs> I played a session. Okay. Christian. Bad. What? Uh... <laughs> Nothing. I'm using <laughs> you as my example of what not to do, uh, sir. Yeah, right, we're, gonna, let's, we're let's... probably going to talk about that a little bit later. Stay uh... Uh, keep going, right. keep going. We'll we'll <laughs> we'll set the record straight later. Just, just get, go for it, Birdie. Just go for it. I completely <laughs> forgot oh, my week somehow. <laughs> All right, did Birdie, I what's just, up? Yeah, I just fuck you up by calling you out. Oh, by the way, welcome to Birdie. It's no, no longer Wednesdays for the boys, so it's uh, Wednesdays yeah, for the no other. No longer one. Wednesdays for the boys. Yeah, fuck that shit. Wow. <laughs> Silence. I mean, it's it's your turn to talk. So go ahead. It's, uh... <laughs> um, my week has been pretty boring. Uh, let's see. What have I done? I've, well, today I binge watched On My Block. So for anybody who watches On My Block or Christian, you just peaced out. All right, sure. <laughs> um, for anybody who watches On My Block and or has finished On My Block, how are you feeling? Because I feel like I just took a bullet to the emotions. Um, other than that, I have watered and fed my cat. I have sat around. I've eaten a lot of food, so that's nice. Um, and that's that's about it. That that's my week. Okay, that's not too bad. I mean, it's, it is what it is. Yeah, Christian, it, you gotta it, start your stream again, buddy. We lost you. It it do be like that, you know. Sometimes, yeah. sometimes it'd be like that, and you know, sometimes like that it'd be. That is true. That is true. Um, well, I guess it's my turn. Um, oh. Uh oh, Razor's Razor. out here gifting <laughs> subs. Razor just did it again. Oh boy, <laughs> it's time for the one month check in. We need like, like, like uh, uh, animations for this shit. You know, I could get that set up, but I haven't had time. <laughs> Sir. I've been Sir. playing a lot of Warzone. I'm sorry. Stop playing your propaganda video games and make our stream better. I'm just kidding. I can figure out how to do it. Yeah. Um, 
Thank you, Razor, for resubbing everybody. We appreciate that. That's fantastic. You didn't have to do that again, like always, but thank you. Oh, jeez. Um, as soon as as soon as That's we get crazy. Um, some eye combats back open and operating, we will uh we'll buy some gift cards for everybody. Um, not everybody. Don't mean everybody. As rewards for people. Um, so my I'm week. In the chat. Yeah, my week has been uh has been pretty wild. Um, uh, my work is going insane because of all of this corona. And that's period. Yeah, that is that is absolutely a thing that's happening. Um, I took last weekend off from pretty much life, <laughs> which I think is a good idea for most people. Um, we'll talk about that a little bit later. Um, what else did we do this week? We've got, uh, oh, the league. I guess I'll get right into that. We'll just start with that right away for me. Um, if you are signed up for the 1v1 solo league, it is postponed. Uh, half, I think three quarters of the fields are closed right now. Um, both Wisconsin fields, I believe Michigan's field is going to have to close because they have the 10 person cap up there as well. Um, we have, um, Chicago is likely going to be closed. My guess is pending mm -hmm. gubernatorial announcement. Um, what is that word that you just used? Gubernatorial. Uh -huh. That's the proper term for when the governor t says you to do something. Says you to do something. Says you to do something. So hey, I says, I says you should do that. So I says to the guy, <laughs> I'm from Chicago. Wait, wait, say the word one more time. Gubernatorial. G you just switch the V for a B. Oh. Gubernatorial. Um, wow. Yeah. All right. So Dude, today on the Family yeah. Learning Channel. Yeah, there you go. You learned something today. Um, and something new every day. It is also, it is also my opinion, <laughs> my strong opinion, and I think the opinion of most of the hosts. I don't know about Christian, but uh, I would definitely recommend if you don't need to be outside, just don't be outside. Don't stay, yeah, don't congregate. Home. Yeah, just, just avoid the situation. Stay <laughs> stay away from public places if you can for a couple days, couple weeks. Let this thing kind of burn itself out a little. Um, if you can, yeah. if you can, if you can, nobody is judging you. If you just absolutely cannot, if you are still expected to be at your workplace or your place of education or whatever it is, then obviously you're excused. But if you're somebody who has the opportunity to stay your ass at home, do it. <laughs> yeah, please do. Um, I don't want to come across as a naysayer or someone that's like doom speaking, but I mean, China, Italy, Europe, it doesn't matter how good you are at preventing this, it's going to spread still. So It's just it's just what the ache do. Yeah, Sometimes you just got to stay gotta, away from people. So Got to let the ache do what it do. As my, F, in the, F, the F, F in the chat. Ache. That's what F she's in the saying. chat for Jeff Black <laughs> here. That's, that's Hi, tragic. Hi, Hi, baby. Um... So that's that's our announcement as a as a podcast. As much as we all love this game and we love playing, it's probably a good idea to stay away for a little bit. Um, maybe not because you are sick or someone that you know is sick or you're in danger, but there's lots of people out there that can't afford to get sick, um, and it would be devastating. So let's just watch out for everybody and just be smart. Um, wash your hands. Wash your hands. Don't get the ick. Keep the community healthy and safe. Yes. Absolutely. Anyway. So that being said, the one v one solo league is on is on hold. It's not canceled. We're still gonna do it. Um, it's still gonna be nine weeks for the first season. Um, and likely what's gonna happen is, uh, one week after all of the locations reopen is when we'll get started. So if you would like to join the waitlist, still we do have a full league, but you can join the waitlist because I'm sure people will have real life that's gonna get in the way. Uh, just go ahead and sign up. Um, and we'll go from there. Everything's ready for it. Um, I was ready to do the pods today, but um, we're going to put those off until next time. Um, we did. We were going to have a surprise guest tonight. Unfortunately, the surprise guest uh, had to go to bed early because we uh. started late. <laughs> and he has to work at mm. 630 in the morning. Uh, uh, Defenestrate, our, our moderator with the heavy hammer in the chat, was going to join us for the first half. Um, he says Z's. But he's he's literally <laughs> in the bedroom right now. So um, you uh you catch them Z's, boy. Yeah, get the bed. Yeah, you catch Z's, then the ick. Holy God! <laughs> and that's period. 
Yes. Um, we do have another pretty cool um, thing going on today. We have some uh, contributions from our Madison field. Uh, we're going to have a little, uh, little exclusive video coming up in a little bit. Uh, I was talking to Vic from, I think, the New Jersey field. He's going to probably come on next week. Uh, he wants to talk about their field and what they do out there, special events and that. Uh, so hopefully if everything goes well, we can get Vic on for next week. And, um, yeah, I think we're, unless you guys got any other topics you want to cover before we get started, we can just jump into the top tens and, and see who did well this week. All right. Let's, Hearing nothing. Um, I'm not seeing anything. Uh, let's I'm, wait. There I'm hearing go. a huge go for it. Awesome. So, here we are. Top 10s for the week, everyone. Congratulations for those who made it. Uh, one thing I did not get to look up this week because I've been busy and playing Warzone and dealing with work. Uh, uh -huh. People that got their wings, I know of only one person that got a general star this week. Uh, we'll announce that at the end. Um, but if you did know anybody that gets wings, please put those in the chat and we'll call them out when it gets to the appropriate time. Also, you're going to see me almost touch my face a lot. I'm really trying not to touch my face. It's fine. Just wash your hands. It's good Matthew. hygiene. Yeah, but still, you shouldn't do it. Just wash your hands. All right. Just wash your hands. I like that. All right. We're going to start out with Chicago, as always. Um, oh, uh, Birdie, I'm going to put you in order of watching the chat and catching all the people who get wings, okay? Oh, Lord. Okay. Thank that you. That means I need to change things. Yep. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm on just it. Just write it down on a notepad or something. Oh, okay. Or, or you just do you. <laughs> I didn't want to put you on the spot. Sorry. All right. Um, we're going to start with the top 10 for Chicago. 10th place, Liana Sparkly, 33,000 points. Number nine. Um, she also got her wings. <laughs> oh, she did. I see that right there. Literally just got her wings. Congratulations. Yeah. Oh, we got Sunday. Number, wow. number nine, that. Speed Runner, Grocery Store Aficionado, getting 33,000 points. Number eight is Out, 34,000 points. Number seven is Juicy with 34,000 points. Number six, Got Commander out. Irwin, 35,000 points. Number five, Tiberius, 39,000 points. Number four, The Owl, 41,000 points. Number three, Killer Cobra, 42,000 points. Number two, Mr. X-Ray Gun, 43,000 points. And number one for the week, Ben Big Mac, our ex-host from last week, who is still not birdie congratulations sir 62,000 <laughs> points oh yeah claim the title of not birdie um levi also got his wings uh yes yeah levi congratulations on your wings good job levi or good job david good job david oh my goodness there it things comes. are happening hot damn we got some more subs being handed out thank you very much ben wow. biggest mac oh jeez guys we you know what? That's gonna that's gonna make me go ahead and check. No, we still. Wait, maybe that's wrong. It's saying that we got thirty four sub points, so we may need to get fresh subs. Get tell your fresh friends sub. they need to join this chat, because we've been sitting at thirty three, uh, thirty four for a month now. Um, I send Snapchats to everyone in my contacts list. So like, that's amazing. Thank you. If if they're not supporting us, then that's on them. Fair. That is fair. Yeah. <laughs> um, everybody on the list this week, I think, is a repeat person. So I don't think we need to go into a lot of depth on the new players here. Looks like we got a couple people at 28 kill streaks, uh, a couple 24s. Yeah. No one's over three for the KDR, though. That's uh, That's impressive. That hasn't happened in a while. Everyone's trying so hard guys everyone's trying so hard yeah really giving it your all trying so hard got so it's far working. in the end the point uh, is all that mattered i would <laughs> like to say shout out to killer cobra for reaching the top 20 before his 100th session oh I that saw is how correct it, i saw that post i saw that congrats okay. sir i saw that okay um what else do we got here so i also if you can see up there um i did put 11 and 12 up there uh, just missing in number eleven was Hover Vibes, Hover. and once again, just missing the top ten. Levi Ackerman, that man cannot hit a Levi. top ten if his life depends on it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not calling you out, Levi, but come on. 
when when it happens, we'll throw a big, see what had a, happened a big was... podcast party. <laughs> so what's it is? We absolutely what had... the entire the entire podcast will be dedicated to uh, Levi's triumphs. <laughs> so, <laughs> Levi's <laughs> triumphs. There you go. Yeah, <laughs> he's gonna uh, twenty three thousand. Thousand points. Yeah, he's close. Mm. He's just got to score 10 more. That's two sessions. So, mm-hmm. All right. Let's move on to our second location here. We've got Madison. Yeah, moving along. Moving along. Uh, tenth place, Flo, don't blind fire. Ninth place. Oh, sorry. <laughs> she got 13,000. Uh, ninth place, Water, triple O one, thirteen thousand 13,000 points. Number eight, Nick Water. Belt. Mm-hmm. 13,000 points. Number seven, Mac 20 with 14,000. Number six, Mad Trap with 15,000. Number five, Stormy Dungeon, 18,000. Number three, Live for the Moment with 19,000. Number three, yeah, Madison right. Employee, 21,000. <laughs> Number two, Doki, 30,000. Number one, J.D. Jenkins with 36,000 points. I'm seeing total player card here. I like it. Yeah, uh, we do have good. we do have some new players on that list. Uh, if you guys want to talk about that, I'll pull up the. Uh... So, what do we got? What how do we did got? I just get called out? <laughs> Who did? <laughs> Me. What'd you get called out for? <laughs> Levi is about the same consistency, missing top ten as Bernie is missing the stream. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I have an educational life that I need to attend to, sir. Please Dang. leave me alone. Someone got roasted. I'm graduating after this semester. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Christian, you are? Yeah. Yes, honey. <laughs> I'll have more time to do nothing. Are you going to have your associates or your BA, babe? Uh, associates, then I go to my PT degree. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Make a okay, move. Okay, okay. Why did my shit get so laggy? Stop. Alright, well, I don't see any notes uh, for our different players that made the top 10 this week, so we're gonna we're gonna skip that for Madison. I'm not sure who Water is. Um, I assume that Madison employee is some idiot noob that plays up there. Um... <laughs> Well, <laughs> Flo, I think that might be her first or second time on the top 10. She's a, a pretty strong regular up there. She'd been missing an action for a couple weeks, but good to see her back up there. Uh, 11th place, we had Black Horse Blades. Nice. And then in 12th place, they had Murder. Oh, Moderately Bad Bish. Moderately Bad Bish. Moderately Bad Bish. <laughs> moderately <laughs> Bad Bish. <laughs> You That's can, an you can name. in fact kill her. She's I, just I love how character. creative people get, man. Like, and then the whole reasoning behind everyone's name, like it's, it's moderately great. bad. I want to do it. You can uh. kill them halfway. You can reduce their life halfway, but nothing beyond that, because there's no way that you can kill a moderately bad bit. That's that's not how the logic of being a bad bit. Works. <laughs> yeah, science fair. doesn't back that. It's science. It's science. That's all I had to hear. Why is my whatever? All right, and our our general star is up there at number one for that location. J D Jenkins picking up his first general star. Congratulations! Hey, hey, hey. first star. Yay! I want to say congrats. You put in the hard work. You deserve it. Congratulations. Yay. Okay. 36,000 points. Hey, Burb. Hey, Burb. Yeah. Redo your mm-hmm. camera. It's lagging. Hold on. Do everyone. Let me try and fix. Yeah. You just have to reload it usually. Okay. I say, everyone, give yourselves a pat on the back if you made the top 10 for your map because it does take a lot of money and time. So. True story. <laughs> um, it takes. It, it, it's. Let's see. Yeah. It works. You hear it every time, but it is the most expensive gym membership you will have. So. Perfect. Nice job. <laughs> yeah. um, top kills for the week. We got uh, Fern live for the moment with 24. Matt yeah, Trap had a 22 kill streak. 
Uh, everybody, oh, uh, Mad Trap had a four KDR. Everybody else was two or lower. So congratulations to all you guys. Oh, well alive. done on the top tens. Off to Michigan. Michigan. Golf clap. <laughs> Tenth place Michigan. for Michigan. We got Kill Switch with twenty-seven thousand points. In, oh, oh, oh yeah. Oh, you're just hyping. Okay. Uh, yeah. Ninth yeah. place, <laughs> Snake23 with 31,000. Eighth place, we had Topher Dude with 35,000. Seventh place is Jelly Ellie Bean with 35,000. And sixth place, we had Tyler with 26,000. In fifth oh, place, yeah. 10 p.m., 37,000. Fourth place was Sharp Shooter with 38,000. He got Third his second place. general star. Oh, yes, he did. Congrats. Oh. Third place, Black Good Attack, 47,000. Second place, Thermit the Frog, 59,000. And first place, Meth Morrow, 92,000 points. Michigan putting a pretty regular week up, I think. Um, but in the, that's a lot of points. It's dang. a lot of points, but, I mean, most of those scores are pretty are pretty normal. Oh, God, bird your camera again. Make it stop. Dang. Again? Yeah. It looks like Oh, maybe I... Mm. On R and it's a purple blob. Yeah, you're a giant purple mess to me. Sorry. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So everybody here is doing pretty well. Um, Meth keeping his KDR up. Uh, Tyler is a newer player to the list. Let me see here. Uh, still looking <laughs> for input from other players. And We've got anything on. Everybody else is a. Repeat. So congratulations. Repeat. Yeah. Uh, good Keep job keeping your keeping your rep up, keeping your stats up, keeping absolutely just basically showing the reason why you've earned what you have earned. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, why is that happening? I'm checking the chat to see if anybody. Uh... Hopefully it'll stop. <laughs> I'm checking the chat to see um, if anybody's got any input on Michigan right now. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, just the normal. Indeed. Welcome back again. <laughs> Natalie, just the normal, would. the normal trash talking in the chat from the Michigans. I like that. Comments are pretty funny on yeah. my nasty ass the camera. Mich yeah. oh. The Mich the Michigans are are holding their own in there. I love this. Mm. By the way, I call you guys Michigans because I love you. Hopefully that's okay. The camera, think... the camera is okay out of ten. By the way. Oh, wonderful! Love that. Love being just good enough. <laughs> Um, by the way, uh, folks out in Michigan, I didn't see any announcements, but is Kim closing your guys' field? Are you guys going to be shut down for a while? Oh, yeah. that's. I know you emailed her. Did you ever get a response? No, I, I figured she's like you. crazy busy right now. Yeah, the field is shut down. Okay. All right. Well, I figured. I go. saw your governor announce that it was maxed out at oh, okay. 10 people. So. Okay. okay. That is unfortunate. All right. Um, Just yeah. a matter of time till it's us, boys and girls. Oh, it's, yeah, maybe. Yeah, it's coming. I can't wait to have to call I'd... 25 plus customers and tell them they have to reschedule their moves for three weeks from now, earliest. Uh, I hate it already. Yeah, maybe I'd like a Cries week off, in logistics. you know? Like... <laughs> Cries in logistics. <laughs> Christian, I hope that you get the week off that you're hoping for. Because, you know, it's always nice to have an unprecedented break. Yeah. yeah. Good, old, good old breather. Relax. Do some things Don't you she... haven't done in a while. Don't you know how many weeks I take off in a in a year? Like No, that's oh. all right. We're just going to pretend like you deserve <laughs> it. Okay, cool. <laughs> nice. All right. Ooh, bless me. Uh we are going to move on to Waukesha. Yeah, you are blessed, Chris. Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> um over up in the wonderful land of Waukesha, which by the way, I'm going to say for everybody out there, lots of stuff is happening here. Um May not be a lot of it that's out yet, but there's a lot of behind the scenes stuff happening with Waukesha. I think you guys are going to be really happy about that. I can't announce anything, of course, but there's announcements of pre announcements to announcements. Keep your eyes out. Some and stuff that may that. be happening in the future, <laughs> and it's exciting. So there Isn't you go. It, didn't they post a lot about what was going on in the, the page or no? Yeah, there's a fair amount, but there's also a significant amount that's happening off screen as well. Oh, okay. Yeah. I see. So hopefully if things or go well, maybe we'll have some more exclusive announcements in the future as I'm breaking my microphone here. What are <laughs> we are a hot mess, as per yeah, usual. Yeah, we are. It's 
It's one of them days. All right, 10th place over in Waukesha, Harry Poppins, 15,000 points. Ninth place, Delirium, 19,000 points. Eighth place, Unicorn Rage, 19,000 points. Seventh place, Turtle, please stop playing, 20,000 points. Sixth place, Prince Waukesha, 22,000. Fifth place, Joker, 23,000. Fourth place, Ash Away, 24,000. Third place, Big Omdahl, 26,000. Second place, Frog Champ, 33,000. And first place, Sniper 17 with 59,000 okay. points. Okay. Once again, we have a full location of regulars hitting the top 10. There is not a single new name in there. Mm, all right, all right, all right. The regular showing. Yeah, I've, regular I've, showing I, I said up this. I said this. Putting the hours in. But they're yeah. showing up, proving why they deserve what they deserve. Absolutely. There we go. You said, Turtle, please stop playing. Uh, the location's closed down now. You might as well play this weekend. Don't you dare. I am a terrible thing. Stay your ass at home. Do not listen to me right now. Do well, not I mean, if they don't close your if you, they don't close your location, you have to be there anyways because you're working. So. <laughs> you get to be a part of the ick, and you don't get to reap any benefits. <laughs> I'll tell you something. If that if that patient count doubles again tomorrow like it did today. Sorry, nope. Mike. Sorry, <laughs> no. Mike. That ain't it. Here are my two weeks, fam. Yeah. If you're not closing, I am. Um, eleventh place we had Princess Waukesha, twelfth place the owner, sixes and sevens. Just outside of the Princess top 10. Waukesha? Mm-hmm. Who that? Who that is? I assume someone related to sixes and sevens, possibly. Maybe. That would be clever. By the That'd way, I'm going to go back a page here. We didn't get uh, Michigan's 11th and 12th is Death Me- Mechanic and Hogs. <laughs> Someone give them the hog. Give them the hog. Oh, my. And Tough then forward. over in Madison. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we talked about them. Moderately bad bish. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> cool. Oh, Frog Champ says it is not someone related. Power is weird. Who is it? old folks home away. <laughs> That's not funny, but it is. <laughs> Damn it. Why are the old folks bad. home away? Yeah, from doubling our, our case count. Okay. <laughs> Dude, down in Willowbrook, I'm not even joking, 25 people in one old folks facility, 20 patients and four staff. All right, sir, what's that cost? Christian, stop coughing. What is that? I'm glad I, I'm not next to you. What are you I doing? I choked on my saliva, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Can we get F in the chat for I Christian? I don't believe you. I just played a session. <laughs> Paul's in the chat. Ray, Ray dropping the eyeballs on you, sir. <laughs> Ricola in the chat. <laughs> oh, God. Jesus Christ. I mean, Edward was just in the car with me, so y'all have to avoid him, too. Ah. Uh, Frog Champ says Prince and Princess are Delta fixers. Oh, okay. Ah. Ah, ah, ah. Thank you, Frog. Once again, once again, committing to the uh, the contributor role very well. Thank you so much. That's cute. I like that. That's cute names for them. All right. Here is your top 10 continual leaderboard updates. We have a defined top 10 now. Um, Ooh, cool. Shooting Yo. from the top down. We've got Commander Irwin still holding strong with six boards. And tied for second place, Whoa. we've got Black Attack, Doki, Jelly, Killer Cobra, Meth Morrow, Sharpshooter, and Thermit the Frog hitting five boards. That's one every week. After that, we've got a slurry of people sitting with four boards, starting with Ash Away. Then we got Barney, Ben Big Mac, and these Dutts, Rainbow, Sniper, <laughs> Speedrunner, the Owl, he Tiberius, <laughs> and then an army sitting at three, starting with... 10 p.m. Aravan, Frog Champ, Harry Poppins, JD Jenkins, JFG, Juicy, Late Apex, etc., etc., etc. John L. <laughs> John L., quote unquote. Nice. I mean, I don't know. I still don't know how his name is still what it is, but that's fine. Uh, no H, and you're good. That's true. So congratulations to all you folks in the continual top 10. You guys are really putting in the time and the effort. We 
Love you for it. You are the backbone of this place. Hearts to you guys. Give them the guns in the chat for the top tens. That's period. That's pretty cool, guys. Everyone everyone in Chicago might want to avoid me when I'm at work. So. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you said you was choking on your saliva. You yeah. lying? What's going on? We're getting gaslit right now. This is how yeah. this shit <laughs> spreads, Christian. Take responsibility. Damn it. I need Damn it, money. Bobby. I need money. Bitch, you was spending it. You wasn't even working. That was true. Yeah, I'm trying to pass Nightmare. All right, we're moving on from this now. All right, guys, we're going to go into our uh, our next section here. Uh, we're going to go to one of our exclusives. We're going to have a, uh, a quick video for you. Um, it's genuinely a quick video. Uh, this will probably take 10 seconds or so. I'll play it a couple times. Uh, this is... I was going to say, you can also have it on loop. Just loop it while we're talking. But I can try that. I haven't done the videos on here before, so I don't know how it's going to work. Uh, I, also, I also have some audio, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to mute us, and we're going to play it a couple times. Um, Okie dokie. Okie there. Yeah, hopefully... <laughs> Oop. Okay, you just, is it possible Oop. for Midwesterners to just oop past the corona? Be like, oop, oop. didn't see you there. <laughs> oop, didn't see you there. Right. Okay, there. All right. So, virus. as soon as I change the scene here, we're going to be uh, we're going to be muting everybody now. Oh yeah. All right, fam. So what you're looking at there, and it's not playing the audio, is the IR saw up in Madison, Wisconsin. Oh my God, that shit is. It that'd be looking some type of way. Yeah, that thing is a that thing is a monster. Um, let me see if I can get the audio to play. There we go. Now the audio's playing. So you'll see that it is fully automatic. The uh, the weapon itself, he's going to shoot it here in a second. I'll, I'll shut up. Yeah, so the vi the for the host, I don't think the host can hear it, but uh, the gun is fully automatic. It has a, um, what's it called, a, a, a overheat mechanic. So if you hold the trigger down too long... It does, in fact, overheat and then lock up for a couple seconds so you can't shoot it. Otherwise, from what I understand about the weapon, is that it does unlimited ammo, so you never have to reload it. Oh, shit. And it does pretty high damage. Um, I think... That's period. I Define might mess pretty up. high. I think, well, I mean, it's either 50 or 32 damage, I'm assuming. Um, Third. Let me see... If, 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 uh, yeah, easy Hell's Bells win. Nice. I didn't even think about that, Ray. That's gross. Mm -hmm. Um, if, uh, Fern, or if you're in the chat, message me on Discord. I'm going to try and get you in here so we can talk about this for a second. Ooh, I like it. I do liking it. It's going to mess up the chats, but it's okay. <clears throat> I'm just going to keep that video playing for a little bit for you guys. Best man, it's 25 damage. Oh, there he is. All right, I'm going to add him to this call. Live for the moment. Oh, My oh. guy, I go to when I need help. How do I do this? It do be looking How fresh. How do I up. add a person? <laughs> True. I hope this doesn't break everything. Uh. It did. It totally broke everything. He just said that he hoped it. He would. Yeah, not. it absolutely broke everything. <laughs> it broke everything. Okay. I can't believe you've done this. Hold on, let's see here. Hey, can you guys hear me? You can't. Shit. Okay. 
All right, stream, just hang out for a second. We're going to get this. We're going to get this. Da, 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 da. Do that thing. I'm breaking everything. Has... Okay, but... You need to hmm. get your shit together. I do. Oh, that's how you do it. Add friends to DM. There we go. America. How is this Kansas? And this is not is our not Kansas. There he comes. <laughs> what do you mean, Arkansas? Ah, Fernando. What up, baby? Oh, What's up, my dude? How, how's quarantine going, homie? Oh, dang. You coming to Chicago, bro? Like Hi! Yeah. Hi, sweetness! It's so good to see your face! <laughs> I like how there's a lag in the background. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright, Fern, what can you tell us about this awesome weapon, sir? Can I buy a season in toilet paper? <laughs> um, well, for right now, obviously, we are closed. Um, but when we reopen, uh, anybody can test it out. Uh, for free, and then obviously there's going to be a upcharge after that. Okay. okay. Um, and then besides that, like Evan mentioned in the chat, it does take four shots to kill anybody. But it just mows people down. So. That's pretty wild. There's that. Yeah, like compared to the SMG, it does shoot a little bit faster. Mm -hmm. Same, yeah. So it'll mow. Um, but besides it'll mow. that, the SMG, I believe, is still dominant compared to the saw. Okay. Okay. And was I right that you don't have to reload it? No, you do not. As you heard in the video, there is a cooldown timer after a while. Okay. Um. But I believe if you played any like video games, you know how like the the machine gun mm -hmm. overheats after a while, and if you stop, it cools down. But if you shoot one more time, it continues on to where you left off. Okay. Oh, oh interesting. Okay, I gotcha. Yeah. So how people keep asking, how heavy is it? What's the it what kind of weight are we looking at? Kind of heavy, but um, after a while, you might get used to it. But you'll get tired halfway through the session. I'll tell you that. Yeah. Okay. 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 Oh, so that heavy. Okay. So, that <laughs> so it's like heavy. the shotgun where your one arm is just dying at the end of the session. Yeah. <laughs> So okay. It's, uh, yeah, it's all pretty about much. Training. But the shotgun's a little bit worse. Sorry, I'm like hearing you guys from the TV. I can't really hear you from my phone. Oh, fair, oh, fair, fair. Sorry, okay. that's why you're on a delay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Makes sense. All right. All right. Um, wow. Do you guys have one of them? Two of them? We have two of them. Um, okay. it's gonna be one per team, and then it's a first serve. What is it? Yeah, first, first come, first, first serve. First serve. Okay. Yeah. Sweet. So like the shotgun. One for, like the shotgun, one per team, first come, first serve. Nice. Well that's so, good. Yeah. Now when's the point where we get all like we get the SMG, the shotgun, and the IR saw in the one map and then we have a Ooh, ground yeah, war. And oh, hell yeah. I can't wait for the ground war that'll happen. And like <clears throat> Yeah, that'd be pretty hot. <laughs> that'd be fun. Yeah, I'm just saying Chicago, you know, yeah, uh, should have it there. Okay. That's period. That'd be Sweet. awesome. But yeah. Less driving for me. Yeah. Any other questions in the chat about the guns or anything like that? Yeah, I don't, I... I don't think I see any right now. Mm -mm -mm. Everyone's kind of saying uh, it's going to be awesome on like Jailbreak, Hell's Bells type of games cool. where you can just hunker down. Ooh, Everyone's already... Ooh, now that you mentioned Hell's Bells, Hell's Bells... <laughs> That gun go crazy. That gun, it misses <laughs> every single shot. So if you were wow. to get somebody on the opposite team that has it, you would want to keep them away from the bell tower. Yeah. A hundred percent. Yeah. Like that, that whole like angle from the, from the cannon over to the guard tower, like you mm -hmm. just put the saw there and you just mow down anybody that goes through that area. Right. <laughs> Oh yeah. man. <laughs> he said essentially yes. <laughs> so are you guys even gonna be allowed to like keep your front windows on the bases open now with this thing? Because like you could literally just park a guy at the spawn tube and that's like a hundred percent fire. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
A yeah, imagine how triggered I'll be if you're watching, someone will get looking at you, buddy. sniper, though. Except for the cooldown timer. <laughs> Fair. Yeah. That's pretty cool, though. Awesome! Great! Can't wait! It's gonna awesome. be great when we can play again. <laughs> what is yeah, going on right now? Hopefully this whole <laughs> corona thing goes away, and then... Yeah. We open up again. <laughs> yeah, we can get back out there. Woo! Sweet. Till then, I'll be collecting uh, Trump's unemployment. <laughs> that's, that's period. <laughs> Waiting for that check, honey. Send me my bag. <laughs> nice. All right. Cool. Well, Fern, thank you very much for the exclusive. I appreciate it. Yep. Thanks for having me on. I got to go walk through some kitty right here. Oh, yay. Puppy yay. walk. All right, pups. So, I'll see you guys later. Have right. fun. Bye, Fern. Have Thanks a good day. Stay Bye safe. Wash your hands. Don't get the ick. Oh, <laughs> trust me, I will. <laughs> oh, no. Bye, Dislike, everyone. unsubscribe. All right, later, buddy. I'm hanging up on you. I love you. Hey, right, bye. All right. Yay. That was fun. Good times. Uh, power, save your Trump bucks. <laughs> yeah. So, if you or anybody you know wants to be on the host or on the show, go ahead and shoot us a message. We'd be more than happy to get some of you guys on here. Join the fun. All right. We are going to close. Oh, that why window. is my face big? What are you talking about? It went away. Oh. <laughs> there was two of me, which, like, I won't complain because, like, twice the fun, but. Fair. <laughs> All right. Um, so that was fun. That, that gun looks like it's going to be pretty awesome. I'm pretty it's excited. It's going to be that great. One. It's like, this is where I would put my IR saw if I combat was open. <laughs> this is where I'd put oh my IR. Yeah, true. I never get that excited for, like, new, like, newly released weapons. But you know what I am excited for? A pistol. That sounds like fun. That yeah, sounds does. like a lot more fun than a heavier gun. <laughs> I'm not oh, really yeah. sure that I'm signing up for that. Yeah. But Sean has pistol? some pretty good pretty good I'm videos in. of the pistol being used down in uh Missouri. That was pretty fun to watch. Yeah, I won in on that action. Let's go down there after the ick is done. Uh, yes. You know what? When the ick is done, <laughs> I'm when, down. The, when the ick is done. Yeah, when it just decides that it's bored. Okay, cool. Basically, um... <laughs> when the ick packs up and moves out of town. <laughs> I am in. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, powers, answer your question. No, that's not a live video on YouTube. That's something that Fern sent me directly. It's just a quick seven-minute uh, clip. We got the oh, leak. Okay. Yeah, we got we got that exclusive. That's live coverage there. That's why you should watch the podcast. <laughs> why you should get your friends to watch the podcast. Absolutely. Period. All right. Um, how do you guys feel about going on to talk about our mission for today, which most of us have not played? I'd be like This should be fun. All I right. Wanna play it. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen of the chat and jury, our conversation today is about the wonderful fun game espionage. Sweet. I have zero insight. <laughs> yeah, literally I have nothing. I think I'm the only one in the game here or in the chat podcast whatever we're doing, um, that's actually played this game. Did you forget um, where you were? <laughs> yeah, I, I'm delirious. I got the ick. Uh -huh. Oh, he's got the ick all day. It's not me. <laughs> Hang up. Right. Um, yeah, yeah, you can, cat you I, can catch it through uh, <laughs> yeah, audio I transmission. Feel... Yeah. <laughs> it's, like, uh, it's like, what's that, bird box, where you can catch it watching the monitors? Spoilers. Oh, God. Okay, yeah, we're done now. That's terrifying. <laughs> We're done. <laughs> so I don't uh, be liking it. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna lead a little bit here uh, with espionage because I have played it a bunch, a bunch being like a dozen times maybe. Um, espionage is a pretty fun game. Uh, for the people in the chat that haven't played it, the closest um, equivalence of a game in Chicago is gonna be Military Intel. Um. The main rules of espionage are there is one bag, only one bag, middle of the map. 
Um, I know this game is played on Madison, and it's played on. We're going for circles. Um, it's played <laughs> it's on Madison. It's middle. played on um, Waukesha. Um, I don't think they play it on Michigan because Michigan's field is super tiny. But the object of this game is to get to the single bag and bring it back to your base. Uh, there are a couple of rules that go along with that. Uh, Madison, I know that the bag is put up in the clock tower. So you have to actually get into the clock tower, up the stairs, get the bag, go back down the stairs, and then back to the base. Oh, I think I remember that. Um, Have I played it? Or... It's, a, it's a pretty... It can be a pretty competitive game. It's also one that's usually pretty quick because once a team actually gets the bag, it's not too difficult to get it back to the base. Um, over at Waukesha, it's actually a lot harder because they actually hide the bag inside of a locker system. So they have a locker set up underneath one of the staircases, like all no those like, little, like, what are they, like one by one lockers that you have in school for gym. And when you get over there, you actually have to open up each locker to find the bag. So you're exposed while you're doing that. And then you have to get the bag and bring it back to your base. Okay. Uh, they also start. Okay. I think for that game, they start in different locations. So you don't actually start at your spawn. You start as far away from the bags as you can. So the first is a rush across the field to get to the bag. And then you have to capture it and bring it back. Um, the folks that are in the chat can correct me, but I believe that there's no limit on lives for this game. I think you do have unlimited lives. Um... And that's about it. It's a it's a quick game. I I actually have been petitioning for us to play it instead of military intel on Shanty. Oh, T. I think it's a better game on huh. Shanty uh, than playing. Interesting. Yes, I was correct. Yeah, it is unlimited lives. Um, I think it's a better game than playing military intel because it seems like it'd be a lot safer for our field. Look, so much safer. People just need to know how to not run. Right. A, a cool, a brisk walk, baby. Mm -hmm. A brisk walk. That's uh, all you need. Yep. Walk. Um, it's a fun game. Um, safe, right? The <laughs> the basic strategy that I've seen from people is you really just rush the bag with a couple people and pray that you have a person standing at the end of it. See, something leads me to believe that it's not safer by the term rush. <laughs> Rushing well, the bag. Right. Well, their fields, they have a lot more artificial speed checks. Like, you have to go through a doorway. You have to turn a corner sure. to go up the stairs. Right, 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 like, right, Like, right. Shanty, you're literally just... For Shanty, it's a surefire down, down, down the middle. Yeah. Yeah. Straight down the old hallway. Uh, Night OFS. Steve, we love you, buddy. Night. Yeah, safe is safe is an interesting word at I combat. <laughs> um, yeah, that's what we call a placeholder word. Yeah. The my definition of running is anything that you can't stop yourself on one step. So mm. if you're going quick enough where you need to take like two or three steps to slow down and stop, you're going too fast. Mm -hmm. Like if you can plant yourself within one step and stop. You are going quick enough where you are in control, and I think that's okay. What if you run fast enough that you stop in one step, but you slide, but no, and it's still fast. in that one step? It's nope. still in the one step. You have to plant nope. yourself. That's called traveling, sir. Yeah, Anything I think the real issue, NBA, like with whistled, and that's a turnover. With running and like knowing how fast you're going and stuff like that is like I feel like you don't really know how fast is like dangerous until you're trying to stop and somebody else is running directly in front of you or mm. <laughs> past you and you can't stop fast enough to not run into them which you know it happens all the time but anyway right. um so neither of you have played this up in madison or anything i don't uh -uh. think so not that i can remember i played terminator where did you say in madison the bag starts uh, the bag is up in the clock tower. Okay, so I feel like I remember this, but I, I'm honestly not 100% sure. Like, if I did, it was the very first time that we went there. 
Okay. So at least a year and a half ago, maybe more. Right. I've seen some interesting advanced strategies. Uh, I know there's actually a video. Uh, if you guys want to go watch on the iCombat, I think, official twi uh, YouTube page. They have a tournament that was held in Waukesha, I think, four years ago, where mm -hmm. they used espionage as one of the missions for it. There was some pretty cool strategy from the different games in there where typically <laughs> advanced strategy, cough on the enemy team. Um <laughs> Uh, where <laughs> most, uh, most of the games, yeah, most of the Chemical games were warfare. ended. <laughs> uh, most of the games were ended by people just running straight in and just holding it off while one person grabbed it and ran back. Um, but there was a fair amount of games where the team would actually, instead of going to the bag, um, because on Madison, I'm going to use my camera. Let me make sure this is coming across on the screen right. Okay, cool. So on Madison, like this is, we'll say that my camera is the field on Madison. Typically, <clears throat> the spawns are here and here. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And then you have the mansion over here, the marketplace is in the middle, and then you have the ghetto over here where the bag is hidden. So their spawn points aren't here at the beginning. You actually start over here and over here. You meant Waukesha. You said Madison by oh, accident. Oh, did I say Madison? I'm sorry. I meant Waukesha. Correct. Um, yeah. So... In order to attack the bag directly, both spawns kind of run this way across the field and then up the back alley, and then the bag is hidden underneath the stairs here. Oh, that's kind of interesting. Yeah. So, But then once you die, then you're just going back to your regular spawns. So it right. makes the beginning of the game a little bit artificially longer. So, what so I that's from... why it's... Oh, sorry. sorry just give going. me like 20 more seconds. So when I saw the tournament people do is there would be one team say the team in the bottom they would go straight for the bag right mm -hmm. and so they'd have some people go upstairs in the market some people go attack the bag right away to try and get it and bring it back but then the other team what they did is they came straight down the first hallway where the mm -hmm. truck is in the mansion so this team is going this way and then this team is just coming straight behind them and then they just loop behind and flank them when they go to get the bag Mm -hmm. They let them get the bag out, kill the bag carrier, and then just walk it straight up to their base. Okay, interesting. Yeah, it gives a couple different, um, couple different strategies for actually playing the game. So that's why you say it's really close to military intel because it's the same idea. You're going for a bag, but just one. Yes. Yeah, it's a one team fighting. Mm -hmm. It's it's effectively capture the flag. Yeah. Okay. Why don't we play that on our field? Um, Fields? it's not really playable on Alcatraz because the minute it leaves the shower, whereas I assume is where it would be put, the other team just can't get it because they have to go through I the guess, shower yeah. into the other side of the prison. Um, true. It would I be would playable assume, on Shanty. But it's, it's, the same, it's like the same thing with um, military intel. It's, it's the same deal. Right. It is. But you just have Intel, two bags. Intel, you get to put the bag on the other side of the shower, though, so there's a little bit more risk involved. I feel so like much mod risk involved. Thank you, yeah. I, like, I feel like we can modify the game enough to play it. Like, that doesn't seem yeah. unworkable. Whatever, it doesn't matter. I no, just... you're, you're totally right. I wish we played more games. Um, Couldn't we just put them upstairs? Like, would that make it worse or better? Upstairs? I, don't know. I think... Yeah. Side I feel note. espionage, the bag in the bell room would be... Yeah, the bell room upstairs right. would be a lot better. Yeah. Because you have very little cover coming out of that room. Yeah, exactly. Um, I also think that, this is personal opinion, I think games like Supply Grab would be a lot better if you put some of the crates upstairs. Ooh, T, I I agree! Um, There's always that one regular that goes upstairs during these types of games anyway, just yeah. to get kills. But... Yeah, and I mean, it, well, makes, I... it makes the game safer as well, because then you got players spreading out instead of all running toward one objective. I think the other thing about games like Supply Grab and such like that, though, is that, like, they're quick games, which is good for, like, having more games per session. Mm -hmm. Not necessarily that, like, it's not a good idea to, like, beef them up though more and, like, you know, make them... Uh, more like longer but i do think that it's it's sometimes nice to have like a good like fast paced like quick game just to like kind of get things going like after yeah. games that are like super just long and like okay i've had enough <laughs> that's fair 
I actually uh, I hate military intel at our field. I love playing military intel up in Madison. Like why? those bags are impossible like both... to capture. Oh, I you know what's really funny is I don't think the last time or even like the last two times I've been in Madison, I've played a single round of military intel. There. I think I've also really only played military I intel. Either. My first time you guys going are missing there. Out. I haven't yeah. played. Yeah, I I've don't only even played like... military intel here at home. Where do they put the bags? <laughs> they go in the uh, the two guard towers opposite of each other on the left. On the as you enter their field, they're on the left side. Mm -hmm. Oh, the ones that are uh, no opposite way. Of the bell. No yeah. way. The ones that are oh. overlooking the bell, they go in the basement of those. You know what? No. I was going to say, I think I do remember that, but that's not it. No. I was thinking something yeah. completely different. That game is so wow. much more fun on that field because... That's wild. It, it runs the whole time. It's like elimination, but that's it actually what I was completes like, that's itself. A, yeah, that's a full... That's crazy. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. Yeah, I like that. That's cool. Mm -hmm. I get why you would like that way more than how it's set up on our field anyways. Yeah. But... On our field, it's just whoever gets there first. Did did somebody in the chat say that they play espionage at it's normally hidden out in the middle area with little cover? Okay, yeah. That sucks. Yeah. <laughs> I would enjoy it. For, does it have to be on the first first floor for Michigan or can you hide it up top? I'm curious. Let's see if we get a response. You know what would be interesting? Mm. I just thought about this for espionage if like the team leaders hit it somewhere on the field. Hmm. Oh. I like that. So, like, it's not always in one spot. That'd be wild. Uh, okay, it's ground floor. They never had anything upstairs with ground floor only. Oh, interesting. Yeah, the stairs in Michigan are really awkward to get up and down. I think that makes sense. Yeah. Most fair. of them are incredibly exposed. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. This be true. Yeah. Um, so, having the team leaders hide it somewhere, I like that idea a lot. Team leader. Because that's fighting. how that's how uh, Waukesha is. Huh. The team leader will go out and they pick a random locker and they put it in there and then they don't tell the teams where it is. I think that's interesting. interesting. That sounds a lot more engaged, at least. Yeah. They're that not just seems... like rushing to the same place every time. You've got a real right um, variable for both teams. Then. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That actually seems better. I want to play now. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, Corona! Why? Let's go get the ick. <laughs> Ooh, dang, show up this weekend. Not only would we get in the ick, we'd be breaking the law. How do we how do we start yeah, no kidding. I mean if that gets put into place. But well, anyway. I mean Wisconsin it is. What, the curfews and Yeah, just no ten nothing over ten people. Oh well yeah, that. Um what <laughs> oh, was that. I gonna say? Damn it. Sorry. <laughs> I don't remember. Okay, it doesn't really matter. I just wish we played it at our location now because that'd be really fun. Because I really like military intel a lot, but I do get what you're saying by, like, you know, always knowing where the bag is and also, like, you have to, yada, 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 whatever. But, like, I love the idea of a capture the flag game like that, especially where you don't know where the bag is every single time. That's really cool. Yeah. And so fruitly. <clears throat> Powers, what if we pay three hundred fifty for a private session? Hey. Everybody mm. has to get screened for the coronavirus before they enter. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> and that's period. Dang, it's like I'm working out. in the adult uh, industry, you had to come with your medical exams every six months. <laughs> you need up to date um uh what is it? Oh my god, what is that called? Vaccines. Yeah, but it's like a oh, is it is it immunization the, test? What yeah. do I do? Fax Mike my medical like immunization records? History? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> yeah. Bring your it's immunization like, records we're before coming to the match. Yeah, it's like we're trying to get back into college again. <laughs> a schwoops. <laughs> and a oop and a oop. <laughs> cool. I think uh, I'll, I'll leave the, the conversation going for another minute or so to see if anybody has any input from the, uh, from the chat. But... Um, I think that's going to kind of wrap it up for espionage. It's a really fun game. Um, like I said, if you really want to go watch it being played, I think it's on the Waukesha tournament video. Um, lots of really good players are in that. Uh-oh. What's up, Bird? You got the ick in your room? No, I just hear a lot of 
emergency vehicles. That's cute. I mean, it's not new for the city, but it just sounds like there's a lot of them. Oh, I hear them too, yeah. yeah. It's more frequent. Yeah, Mandrel, I don't know. Mandrill says it's one of his least favorite games. Why is that, sir? Oh my god, what the hell is... Least favorite games? Ooh, food. Teak. Um... What else could be... Sorry, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Anyway. Um, one of my least favorite games. Oh, well. There you go. Oh, man. Okay. Bonus DM because no one finds it back. Oh, yeah. Well, I guess if you have a lot more players who are points and or kill oriented, I could see how that could be lame. Uh, makes sense, yeah. Would see you say that the problem to. is more that nobody's going for the bag because they just don't care about it? They just want to play for kills and not objective, and that's how it usually is? Right. Or the problem is just that like, it's not an effective game for your map because I feel like it could kind of go either way, depending on <clears throat> where you are. Oh yeah, Someone it's um... that. <laughs> uh, I've done that. I've done that. <laughs> so uh, someone fair. hides it to the last second for kills. Yep. <laughs> it's too hard to. Wait, is espionage unlimited kills? Yeah, yeah, unlimited. Life. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. It's never too hard to find then. You're just not tenacious enough. <laughs> Get them. <laughs> Objective be that bitch. You just gotta keep respawning until your finger breaks. <laughs> Jesus. That's fine. Nice. All right. I think that's. I think that's gonna. That's gonna wrap it up for espionage. We've run this train off the rails a little bit here. Love that. All right. Next week. Uh, next week we're gonna continue on our A to Z discussion. We're gonna hit Hell's Bells. That's another. That's a game all the fields play. So. I'm excited. Lots of strategy for that one. Uh, if anyone wants to be on the show, actually, we'll. You guys want to do a, a guest for that discussion next week? Oh, I will sure. always welcome my guests. Cool. Yeah. Um, let's, I'm never uh, gonna say no. Let's let's get a uh, some applications from people in Love the chat. It. Go ahead and uh, I am an avid player of Hell's Bells. Oh, yeah. Hell's Go ahead and Bells message us. Let us know if you want to be on the chat, and we'll uh. Oh man, we'll get a, we'll get a little round <laughs> table going on. Submit all of the the session sessions in which you have played Hell's Bells, and if you have won or not, and we will make our decisions. <laughs> Yeah, stats for Hell's Bells must be recorded <laughs> yeah. for accurate, <laughs> for accurate and viable influences. Fair, love that. <laughs> fair, 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 fair. I love it. Everyone's getting screened. All right. I, everyone's getting screened. All right. <laughs> so I played Hell's Bells today. I'm gonna be the first one with a submission. Okay. <laughs> cool. Awesome. All right. Well. That's all the Fireman Drill wants to be so, on. Okay. Um I think that's going to I think that's going to bring us to the end of the show here. Do you guys got any topics you want to talk about? Wow. Ooh. Ooh. Sixes cool. and sevens loves hell's bells. Uh oh, that's good. That's good. Sweet. Still never met it's, him. Found I feel movie. like hell's bells is just like an all around I combat favorite for all fields because yeah. it's like I love Hell's Bells. Um, I'm not sure about any of the other maps, but I feel it because like I played it in Madison. I had a fun time still. I played it in both maps for Chicago. It's still a fun game no matter what. All right. It is. It is the field for anybody. It is the game for anybody who records that will get your video demonetized and copyright claimed immediately. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, that's true. Thanks, Universal Media Group. <laughs> Assholes. <laughs> just let people play the song anyways all right that is it for mission discussion a to z next week we got hell's bells this week was espionage uh announcements coming up obviously two fields are closed uh wisconsin shut down michigan shut down chicago most likely going to be shut down this weekend <laughs> pending pending lots of people staying home and not getting the ick out there uh, it's, not looking, I, uh, it's not looking good though, i will so. literally be at work tomorrow yeah, I um, I do know that Washington. if yeah if if you are part of the people at those fields who have reserved games, just call up the store. Um, they will 
rebook your sessions, I believe. Um, it's typically uh, yeah. an I- yeah, it's typically an icon we're, thing where they we're don't pushing do for rebookings. Yeah, they don't do refunds typically, so call, let them know that you were signed up, and then get your session rebooked. All right. All right. One v one league is still delayed. Um, like I said, one week after all the fields go live, we'll start that up again. Um, keep checking out the Facebook page for that, and I will update that as new information comes available. I'm going to continue taking signups if, by some weird reason, we get a lot more interest before the start of the league. I can easily extend the entry number of the league. We can go as high as 32 people. So keep signing up if you want to play. If I can get people in groups of eight, we'll keep adding people to the league, okay? Um, I think I think I want to let as many people play as we can because we've got uh, a good thing going here. Love that. Yeah. Um, I will go first with my weekly stuff this week. Um, Defenestrates in Chicago again. He wanted to play Eye Combat. We'll see what happens. Um, oh, there is. <laughs> Yes, for, those, for those of you who don't know, Brady Love and I are engaged, guy, and we were supposed to have a party on Saturday. That got canceled. Um, Yay. <laughs> so everything is getting moved back. Nothing is bigger than what's going on right now, guys. So really keep yourself safe. I'm going to be hunkering down this weekend. I'm not going out much unless I have to. Um, don't hoard stuff. You don't need to. Stores are staying open. Stimulate your local economy. Target was open today. I was just there. So yeah. <laughs> Stimulate your local economy. Buy from local restaurants. They need your love more than anybody else does at this time. Mm-hmm. If you've ever worked in a restaurant or been in the service industry, you know they're going to need your help. Same thing with iCombat. That's why iCombat started their uh, gift card uh, promotion again. I mean, they're in the same boat as the restaurants. It's a service industry. They need to pay rent just like everybody else does. So um, if you are an avid player... Basically, you're saving yourself five bucks right now because you get thirty dollars for paying twenty five. Um, it's yep. a good idea. It's a good idea. Um, yeah, I'm gonna be hunkering down, playing Call of Duty Warzone, hanging out with Birdie, and hanging out with my brother. So, check me online. I believe I'm gonna be Warzone. playing some Warzone after this. So, do that. Replay for the show as always will be up tomorrow, starting at one p.m. Um, oh, you know what? I just realized Michigan and Wisconsin, they're totally closed for the restaurants. Oh. All right, never yeah, mind. For the, folks, doing... for the folks in Chicago, stimulate your local economy. Yeah, as much as you can, I guess, you know. Yeah. If you're going to if you're going to order food out, just order from a place that's local. Yeah. That's all you can do. If you're near Shore yep, Park, they... order from Chasers. They deserve all of your money. Yeah, McDonald's can recover, okay? So. Oh, McDonald's That's will be fine. period. McDonald's That's will be fine. period. Don't go to your local fast food chains. Fuck them bitches right now. No matter how much you want to be Fuck them bitches right now. Unless you really want some old-fashioned Hergis <laughs> Burgess. Also, if this makes you feel any better about that decision, half their employees are probably sick right now. You don't want that food. That might be liable. We may want to say that that's just your opinion. Uh, okay. That is just my opinion. All right. Okay. All right. That's it for my week. Uh, Bird, what do you got going on this week? Um, I'm going to be watering and feeding my cat in my home. Watering so, your cat? Yeah. I have to make sure he's hydrated. Okay. Yeah. He also needs lots of sun so that he may grow. <laughs> okay, Natasha. Um, but yeah. Uh, that's pretty much it. I'm really doing nothing uh, oh. that entertaining this week. Hey. What? I got a, I got an announcement to make. Oh, oops. We we have officially eclipsed the 35 sub points. So we have now 39 sub points. So we will be getting that next tier of emotes unlocked. Oh, Thank you to everybody yeah. that donated subs today. That's period. Big, big subs and kecks in the chat. So I will be working on another emote as soon as it becomes unlocked. Oh, hell yeah. All right, well, I didn't have anything interesting to say, so thank God you interrupted me. I'm literally doing fuck all. (laughs) I have to take care of my cat. I have to see um, you. (laughs) And uh, and, uh, and just uh, 
make sure that I'm staying healthy. Absolutely. That's right. about it, unfortunately. Chris Chan, what do you got going on, bud? So, very, very, very great news to me. To me. I'm not sure if any of y'all will get scared, but my mom is coming back from the Philippines on the 20th. Hey, oh, yay! That's awesome. And, it's, it's and, so and, and, to come home. guess who she's bringing? <gasps> no way! Is she bringing baby R- RJ is going to be living here now. My three-year-old brother will finally be living with me. Oh, It'll be it. amazing. Nick. Hell yeah! Okay, I thought, RJ. And I thought Nick and yeah. I had a big age gap. Jesus. Triumphant return. <laughs> Love that. Yeah, awesome. I'm 23. RJ is three. So uh, <laughs> go, mom. Um, uh, that's another thing. So the reason why I started playing week and week and week is because now that RJ is going to be here, I need to be somewhat, somewhat of the man of the house. So that means someone to take care of RJ. That means I won't be able to play as much anymore. Oh, Christian, uh, love that. that I means should come late. by. We should hang out. <laughs> that means late night sessions will be a no go anymore. So okay. daytime sessions, yes. Night nighttime sessions, I'll have to leave. Okay. We love that. Keeping Fair. keeping keeping good track of the the children. <laughs> yeah, my mom wants me to teach RJ how to play tennis too. So. Oh, cute! Love that. Oh, that's cute. Awesome. Awesome. Very yeah. cool. Congratulations. So that's, that's basically that's cool. it. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm I'm glad. I can't wait for RJ to be back. It's, oh yeah. He's gonna be he's gonna be running around the house. Birdie, hit me with the hell yeah. Everything. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah. Thank you. Hell yeah. <laughs> All right. Awesome. But I will also be down to play Warzone with anyone. Uh, yeah. Chris, you can play Warzone. Absolutely. Yeah. Uh, hit up our Discord. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, I'll link the Discord in the chat here in in, in just a few minutes. Um, but you can organize your groups there. There's always some people that are looking for partners and whatnot. Uh, they did just relaunch solos for that. That's gonna be cool. I don't have to go one v three anymore. Um. When we get start getting knee deep in this quarantine business, I'm about to be in that Discord like nobody's business. So yeah. coming yeah. up, there's, there's yeah. usually a pretty good group of people yeah. chatting throughout the day. I'm about so. to be like, hey, day eight of quarantine, five bottles of wine in. What's up with it? <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Day twenty three. Day twenty three of non stop service. That's what I'm hearing right now. <laughs> yeah, I said this in the Facebook group before, but like everyone's worried about running out of food and water. I'm worried that the internet's gonna go off at some point. But I'm what wh- Target's I'm, open! I'm, <laughs> Bro, if that internet goes out, I don't even know if I know how to entertain myself. Do you play uh, board games? If anyone's, bleed. <laughs> anyone's trying to play Smash, yo, I'm ready. Uh, <laughs> hey, this isn't that kind of chat, sir. Oh, uh, yeah, that's true. Take that to, take that to OnlyFans, okay? PG-13 only. only. Yo, <laughs> check my premium Snapchat, homies. Oh, God. Oh, All right, hey, we're done here. Hey. <laughs> All right, guys. That is, that's going to be the it for episode six. <laughs> Don't get the ick. <laughs> I am Bratz. We've got Birdie and 10K here. Thank you guys so much. We got the full hosting crew here. It was nice getting everyone back together. Um, Check us out tomorrow. Uh, Bowling is canceled for two weeks at least. So I know the stream has been failing those nights, but it's just not even going to try next week because or this week because there is no bowling. So um, that's going to be it for us. I'm going to play some outro music in a second. Um, we love you guys all. Wash your hands. Don't touch your face. Don't get the ick. Stay home if you don't have to go out. And uh, just be nice to your fellow man because we got to get through this together and we're the only ones that are going to be able to do it. So that being said, I know no one's really going to be able to do this for a couple of weeks, but... No, 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 no. If, if you got the ick. <laughs> yeah, if you got the ick, get an ick swap. We'll see you guys later. <laughs> Bye. Yeah, yeah. Yes! <laughs>